Hi, my name is Justin, aka Ghost Reader, and today I'm going to be doing my TBR for the Tome Topo Read Along. Uh, the Tome Topo Read Along is happening from June 29th to July 12th, I believe. And the whole point of the Read Along is to tackle those books that are over, that are 500 pages or more on your TBR that you want to read. So, uh, this is being hosted by uh, Thoughts on Tomes, and I'll post the link down in the description box below to the announcement video for this Read Along. Um, and so there are five challenges and there will also be some bonus challenges um, on Instagram. So if you follow her on Instagram, you can also uh, do those bonus challenges. So the challenges are uh, one, read more than one tome. So that means more than one book over 500 pages. Two, read the graphic novel still being over 500 pages. Um, that includes omnibuses as well, um, which is basically a huge collection of a comic title in one bound book. Uh, three, read a tome that is part of a series. And uh, four is read, um, buddy read a tome. So buddy read one of those 500 page books with someone. And five is read an adult novel. So um, I have three books that fulfill all five of those particular, um, all those five particular challenges. So the first book that I'm going to read for the uh, Tome Topo uh, Challenge, or one of the books I'll be reading over those two weeks, uh, is Americana by uh, Chichimana Ngozi Adichie, uh, Adichie and uh, I will be buddy reading this, so I'll fulfill the buddy read challenge um, for the read along, and this is an adult novel as well, so there's two down right there. So I'll be buddy reading this with Maya over at the Hopeful Maya, um, I will post a link down to her channel below please go ahead go and check it out um, basically this novel is about two if I remember correctly it's about a guy a man and a woman um, from Nigeria one goes to England I think the guy goes to England and the girl goes to the United States and basically it's about um, the culture shock they experience and then trying to become acclimated and to their new environments and how much uh, that they hold on to their original where they come from and then like how they deal with that so um that's what i remember it being about so hopefully that is what it's about <laughs> um and I, but i um really do look forward to um reading this i first heard about it on diana and colors channel and i meant to read this like back in february but uh, i've been reading like a whole bunch of other stuff so i'm really looking forward to diving into this over the course of the challenge uh this and uh, the second book on my tbr is um showa uh, uh history of japan from 1944 to 1953 by shigeru mizuki and i have read number one in this series so this uh gets that um this covers the read two tomes so it covers that one and it also covers read a tome in part of a series so this was number three in the series i have yet to read number two i don't have number two i have three but um i'm gonna go ahead and read it uh, i don't think it can really spoil japan's role in world war ii but um it is about his life and kind of he talks about the history of japan while he's living it so um he was in world war ii he had been drafted or conscripted into japan's army and in the first book basically it covers like his early life basically up to the world war well a baby up until japan i believe until japan bombs pearl harbor um and so the second book covers his time in the army up to 1944 and then this covers um the last two years of the war and then the aftermath of that and japan after the war so i really look forward to reading this i like the first one really well um it is actually a manga so you read it from right to left so i actually was just going to read this for the graphic novel part as well but i wasn't sure if it would really be considered a graphic novel so i am also going to be reading um jeff Meyer's uh, exodus county and if you um have seen my other videos and some other tbrs you know that i've read a lot of stuff by jeff Meyer. i've read um his after death series that he worked on um i've read royal city the first volume of royal city and also read a book um, on Thanos, one of Thanos' comics that he was working on. So this is actually the work that put him on the map. I have yet to read it, but I do like Jeff and Meyer stuff, so I do want to see what this is, because this is the one that, that everyone was like, wow, this is great, and kind of like put him out there. It, um, on Basically put him on the map in the comic book and graphic novel industry. So um, I'm really forward to reading to this, and basically it's um, 
based on it is a story that is told in the town that he used to to well the county that he used to live in and that's all i know about it i don't know if it's if it's like his autobiography i don't think it is but it's a story set in that in that setting so um i really look forward to reading this so that that's really good so that's my tbr for the um tone topple i am glad that it was brought to my attention um i had seen a couple of videos about it but hadn't gotten around to watching them um uh, but maya she asked me to buddy read for because she's also doing the topple uh the tone topple uh, read along and so i looked more into it and it's like oh this is great it gives me a chance to actually have a reason to read some of these books that i would have read but definitely would have come further read them further down the line so if you like this video, actually, are you taking part in the Tome Top Over Your Lung? If you are, tell me down in the comments below and what books you are going to be reading uh, doing the read along. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you want to see more videos from me, please hit subscribe. If you want to follow me on Twitter, you can. That is at GhostWeeds28. And you can also follow me on Goodreads. All of that is down in the description box below. And as always, guys, keep reading.